Hello, baseball fans. Welcome back to Touch Em All, your weekly roundup of all things Major League Baseball right here on Sports Not. I'm your host, Scott Branson, and we've got a packed show with some of the hottest stories from around the diamond. So let's step up to the plate and dive right in. Leading off, the Boston Red Sox are making big moves to secure their future, locking down emerging ace Brayon Bello with a six-year contract extension worth $55 million. This deal also includes an option for a seventh year. Bello, set to showcase his talents in his native Dominican Republic this weekend, is a testament to Boston's commitment to building around their young core. With a journey that started with a modest signing bonus to becoming the ace that the Red Sox leaned on all of last season, Bellow's story is one of resilience and hard work. Next up, Dodgers new sensation Yoshinobu Yamamoto has had an eventful spring training after acing his debut against the World Series champion Rangers. Yamamoto found his second outing a bit more challenging, allowing five runs over three innings against the White Sox. Despite the rough start, Yamamoto and the Dodgers are optimistic, focusing on the valuable experience gained and adjustments made. With one more Cactus League outing left, all eyes are on Yamamoto as he gears up for his Major League debut. All right, swinging over to the Nationals. They're adding depth to their outfield, signing veteran Eddie Rosario to a minor league deal. Rosario, known for his powerful lefty bat and impressive postseason performances, could earn up to $4 million. His experience and leadership could be a game changer for the young Nationals team looking to make waves this season. Rounding the bases, Adolos Garcia is back with a bang on the Rangers. After being sidelined by an oblique strain during the World Series, Garcia returned to action in the Cactus League, immediately making an impact with a 398-foot home run. Garcia's readiness and powerful swing have the Rangers excited for what's to come this season as they aim to defend that World Series title. In a surprising turn during an early March Cactus League game, the Padres showcase their depth against the D-backs in Scottsdale. Jose Azokar's clutch hit set the stage for Graham Pulley, a rising star fighting for his spot on the opening day roster. Facing off against all-star Joe Manipley, Pauly demonstrated why he's one to watch, connecting with a crucial sinker. Pauly's standout performance didn't end there, folks. He shined throughout the game, showcasing his readiness for the majors. As the Padres weigh their roster options, Pauly's impressive spring has everyone talking. Will he be the breakout player this season in the MLB? We'll see. And finally, MLB Spring Breakout is setting the stage for future stars of baseball. This four-day event will showcase the top prospects from every MLB organization, giving fans a glimpse of the exciting talent rising through the ranks. From powerhouse matchups like Jackson Holiday versus Paul Skinnis to the anticipated debut of prospects like Dylan Cruz, the Spring Breakout is a must-watch for any baseball fan. All right, there you have it, folks. Your quick trip around the bases with this week's top MLB stories. Don't forget to subscribe to the Sports Not YouTube channel. Hit that notification bell and give us a thumbs up, if you will. We'll be here all season bringing you the latest from Major League Baseball. I'm Scott Branson, and this has been Touch Em All. We'll see you next week.